Do you want to travel to Japan? Hi, I'm Dr. Muhammad Hashim. I'm a freshly graduated medical student from an Egyptian university. I am going to teach you in these videos the Japanese language from zero to professional. In this video, we will begin with an introduction to the Japanese language. First of all, you have to know that the Japanese is different than any other language in the world. As you can see, the letters of Japanese is different than the letters of English for example. So studying Japanese needs more efforts and more time to be fluent. Today, we will just talk about the Japanese writing system. In Japanese there are three writing system which are 1. Hiragana 2. Katakana 3. Kanji First, the Hiragana. It is a phonetic lettering system. The word Hiragana literally means flowing, or, simple, kana. The word kana means the Japanese syllabaries. Hiragana is an important writing system. We can say that it is base of all our learning in Japanese. Hiragana is super useful in Japanese. You can see hiragana in each phrase in Japanese. The number of letters of hiragana is 46 basic hiragana letters. Each letter of hiragana has a pronunciation which is constant forever. That is considered one of the advantages of the Japanese language. There is no silent letters and no change of the pronunciation of letters from one word to another. For example this hiragana letter is pronounced as ka. We will know all about the hiragana letters in the next video. So, stay tuned. Second, the katakana. Katakana is another writing system of the Japanese language. The number of letters of katakana is 46 basic katakana letters. Did you know this? Yes, it is the same number of letters of hiragana. Guess what? They also have the same pronunciation of the hiragana letters and some of them are close to their hiragana as regards the writing. For example, do you remember the hiragana, ka? This is the katakana, ka which typically the same as its hiragana except that lines are more straight. The uses of katakana writing system are as follow. 1. It is used in formal writing in Japanese. 2. It is used in writing the words which aren't originally Japanese. For example, the country's names are written in katakana. 3. The kanji. Kanji is one of the hardest thing in Japanese language but you have to learn it as it is important in the writing system. Kanji are characters which are derived from the old Chinese characters. Unfortunately, there are more than 10,000 kanji in Japanese. Each has its own shape and its own pronunciation. We will try to make them easy in our next videos. Each kanji letter has two readings. One, kun reading. Two, on reading. The kun reading is the Japanese reading while the on reading is the Chinese reading. The kun reading is usually but not always used when you see a kanji letter followed by hiragana letter. The on reading is used when you see only a kanji letter with no other letters following it. To learn Japanese, learning how to write and pronounce the letter is a must. So, the topic of our next videos will be on the letters of hiragana and katakana, how to pronounce and write their letters. As for the kanji, we will learn it gradually with each lesson of our studying. For now, our introduction video is done. I hope you like it. Give us feedback which you will found its link down in the description. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video to support us. Thanks for good listening and good luck.